welcome to Scotland. Uh, we've currently stopped by some abandoned trains. So we're gonna take a look see at the house and try and have a look at that iron works which is just over there if we can get near it. Right, see you soon. Hopefully it's empty. Yeah, hopefully it's empty. Pass in front. So we just had a look at the stock down there and as you can see there's a lovely engine over there which we'll be taking a look after. Boarded up stations there. On we go, fingers crossed. Here we are folks, just outside the old ironworks now. And we're gonna make our way inside maybe, have a good look around. The weather's improving all the time, it's nice and warm and the sun's coming out, so yeah, should be good then. Okay, yeah, basically we just met a brilliant uh, chap just walking his dog and he explained the whole history of this place. And basically one man came, amalgamated all the plants and started, started this up. And it's wonderful. And this is like either the first place in this area to have electricity or the third, I'm not sure what it, what it was, but history. All right. Let's see if we can find a way in. So, I'll do a bit of 
So this is the upstairs area. I've asked the boys to go downstairs so I can show this to you as you can see. Large open space. The floor is very patchy. So we've done our best Indiana Jones impression and only stepped on the tiles. The correct tiles. As you can see because the floor is shot. So we've got up there and we just took a few minutes up there. Some lovely photographs you've taken because of uh, all the light play etc. They get some fantastic shots. The only problem is all the midges loads of them but uh yeah very good location so i've come downstairs now for a little bit of relief from not only the heat but because of the midges jordan's currently filming in our section so i'm going to walk around here now to show you so apologies as it goes dark and i nearly fall into a hole I need to get a shot of that as well before I go. So as we wander around, As you can see, it's such a shame that such an important industrial building has fallen into such disrepair. Scotland, glory of Scotland. And here's Mr. Kurt Roberts. Yeah, finally got the weather we want. Yeah. Forecast me. Yeah, there's been the weather's been miserable the past couple of days. It cleared up yesterday. Uh, yesterday when we were at the castle. Um, our footage will be going up in a separate uh, vlog. Hello, sir. Hello, YouTube. Thank you. Oh, it's sad, isn't it? See how the iron industry just went. Yeah. Damn you, Tories. It's just too expensive, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Got in. I wonder where all the jokes about Chuck Norris actually started. A guy, a 16 year old guy, he got ripped from it. That's just from, so he did like, was making memes and Alec. So here we are guys, we buy the old kilns. Uh, as you can see they're all boarded up, uh, bricked up rather. But uh, yeah, I'm being attacked again by midges. So we're about to go in another building. Okay everyone, and we're in another little lovely building. I'm up on the uh, first stroke, second floor. And as you can see, the floor is shot. So, so yeah, it's fine. It's fine to come up as long as you take your time. But it's this top section that I've um, got concerns about. But anyway, I'm just still in this section because I know I've got concrete underneath me. But here we are, this is upstairs. And then we got birds roosting up there. Thank you, Mr. Pigeon. That was a lovely shot. Yeah. It's pigeons up there. It is, yeah. So. <laughs> yeah, we'll leave it at that. We both end up in casualty. Here. We're not supposed to be. Um, right. If you're new, guys, please subscribe. I'll give you a like tour now of the and site. The next location. I'm now making my way down from the loft. I'm going to call it the loft because there's roosting birds everywhere. See there, what used to be an old conveyor belt. Taking the raw materials through for processing. Maybe, I don't know what I'm talking about, but it sounds cool in my head. Right, down this section now. Oh yeah, 
that's some nice metal work there. So I'll give you a quick tour. Obviously you get better quality stills, which you can look at at your own leisure on my Flickr page. And then in this room, just if you're stepping back in time, both to the Industrial Revolution and to uh, ancient Greece, ancient Rome, one of those columns there. Amazing. So I'll quickly go into this room. So you can see where the conveyor belt continues up through that window. The larger space and then going up to the second part of the loft up there. So yeah guys, brilliant location. And there's more buildings on site. Okay guys, here we are upstairs in another one of the buildings. And yeah, fantastic. You know, all this vegetation is slowly taken over. That is incredible. Yeah, world location. Hi everybody, uh, we've reached the end of the current explore of this old abandoned ironworks. It's been a brilliant little explore of all the different buildings, seeing some of the machinery there, seeing old locomotives, trailers, etc. And we've walked up this hill now and I assume there would have been a load more buildings up here, but they've been flattened. But look at that countryside. Reminds me of home. Um, there we are, that's a retaining wall there, so it must have been something because they've got slots in the wall. I'm not sure what they were for, but yeah, fantastic location. We're going to head on back now to the car, chill, then on to the next. Cheers guys, thanks for watching.